So my life before Christ, I grew up in a lukewarm Christian home. We attended church on Sundays when it was convenient for us, um, maybe half the Sundays in a year. Uh, so I grew up with a, a basic knowledge of who Christ was, uh, but never really the work that he had done for me. Uh, at a young age, I was introduced into auto racing, and uh, I was six years old and started traveling the country racing. It really became an idol for me, an idol for my family. And with that, it really led us away from the church. We were out of town every weekend. Uh, by the time I was 18, I had worked my way up through my racing career into NASCAR and was at the top of my career doing exactly what I wanted to be doing. Along with that came the, the rock star lifestyle. It was, it was partying in a new place every weekend, um, fornication, infidelity, you name it, I was doing it. Um, and it was really all about me. I thought that in that, as long as I was a good person, other than those things, that uh, God would forgive me when it came time. God really began to draw me to himself uh, as he began to strip those things away from me. The things that mattered most to me in my life suddenly fell out from underneath me. Uh, my racing career disappeared almost overnight. Um, sponsorship fell through and we were never able to, to find another sponsor and doors that were open before suddenly shut um, and, and it was obvious that that career was over and my identity that I had found in that was over. Along, along the same lines at the same time, my uh, girlfriend at the time, my long-term girlfriend, broke up with me um, and it really threw me into a, a deeper uh, depression and uh, more of the partying and trying to find my, my new identity because I, I was a race car driver and now who was I now? Um, so I, I continued to seek and pursue the party lifestyle and, and find fulfillment there. Um, but uh, about six months after that, my girlfriend at the time had invited me to come out to church with her and uh, to appease her I, I started coming uh, and God really used that. Um, I remember a specific night where my, my girlfriend sat me down, ex-girlfriend sat me down and said that we would never be together again because she loved Christ more than me. And uh, I remember that night vividly. It uh, certainly upset me that she could say that she loved somebody that was a historical figure from the past and uh, couldn't love me because of that. And so that drove me to, to church to, to try to figure out who this was that she could actually love like that. And uh, I just remember a, a specific time sitting in church, sitting under the teaching of the Word, realizing the weight of my sin. Um, I broke down crying, uh, realizing my depravity, the sin that I had committed, and the fact that Jesus Christ would give His life as, as a ransom for mine, uh, that His righteousness would be counted as my own, and that I would be right before God. And He used that, he used that time to draw me to Himself. My, my life now, uh, I, I live a completely transformed life. My heart is transformed. My lifestyle has been transformed. I live a life of obedience to Christ uh, and a love for the church and a love to serve others. In my previous life, I was using others to get where I wanted with my career, and now I, I'm loving on others and encouraging them to grow in the Lord. Um, I, while I'm sad that my racing career went away, I'm thankful that as a result of that, I now have salvation.